My name is Colton Boardman. I'm in class 2024. I attend Bishop Gorman High School. I'm a middle infielder and I'm uncommitted. And this is what's in my baseball bag. Start with my uh, the goods. This is my game bat that I use in uh, all the metal bat tournaments. Um, it's 32 inch. I use 32 inches on all my bats, being a smaller uh, player. And then... uh, this is my other metal bat. This is my uh, Louisville Prime 917. This is another 32 inch and um, I don't use this bat as much. I normally stick with the goods, but um, this is just if I'm feeling like swinging a different bat. This is my uh, wood bat. This is a bomb, the gold edition, and um, I've had this for a little while now. And I, I yeah, I, I put lizard skin on it. I didn't get it from uh, the website, but put it on my own because I, I run through them pretty fast. But yeah. Uh, this is my gamer, this is my uh, A2000, and I really like Wilson, all, all of my gloves have always been Wilson, so this is what I use every game, I normally don't stray to different gloves, but... This is my secondary glove. This is a Wilson uh, A2K, and I never really use this glove. It's only if like uh, like one time I had a lace break on my gamer, so I had to use this one. So I normally try to keep it around, just because it's always handy. Uh, this is my All-Star Trainer. Um, this is uh, it's called the Pick. It's very useful when uh, you're trying to just warm up your hands or when you're first trying to take ground balls. Uh, these are my 100%. I use these a lot. This is what I normally go with in a game. And I also have the clear lenses, but I don't use those much because I have uh, Oakleys that I normally use for that. These are my other Oakleys. These, uh, I use these a lot sometimes when I want like a more lightweight that I'm going to be wearing like all day because the 100%s, they get sometimes heavy and they're pretty big on your face. So I'll use these sometimes if I'm trying to like switch something up. These are my Oakley clears. I'll use these at night. Um, it's very rare that I'll use them though because it's normally when it's like windy. I've just uh, I've had them for a little while now, and I just got the clear lenses and put them on a old pair of Oakleys. Uh, these are my cleats. These are the ones I always use for games. They're very lightweight. They're Adidas, and um, I really like Adidas because they're they're always really light and they're good to run 60s in and uh, very quick. These are my backups. I've, I've never even worn them. I, I just have them as a backup just in case I need them, like I forgot my gamer somewhere or those get old and you, know, I, you always just have a backup pair of cleats that's around. These are my batting gloves that I use right now. These are war sticks. I actually just got them like a couple weeks ago, but um, I really like them so far. They've got the, it goes all the way around your wrist. It's really, it's got a lot of stability. It goes around your wrist, so I really like them so far. These are my backups. These are my uh, Franklins. I use I used to use like these like every single time. I, I normally always get Franklins because they're really consistent and they normally last you a good amount of time, but I thought I'd switch it up with the War 6 the last time I got batting gloves. This is my helmet. This is my uh, high school helmet actually. I've had it for a couple, like six months now. Um, I used it during the whole high school season last year and over the summer I used a different helmet, but this is the one I'm using right now since I'm playing with my high school in some games. 
This is my sliding mitt. I've found it really useful. I mean, like a lot of people will get their hands stepped on when they dive into bags. So I've, uh, it's actually come in useful a couple times when your foot and your hand gets stepped on and uh, you're grateful that you had it. This is my elbow guard. I've had this for a while, ever since I was, like when I was little, I got hit in the elbow and it swelled up big time. So I uh, bought an elbow guard after that. So I've, I've had, I've always been wearing elbow guards. Uh, these are my J bands. I normally, or almost always use these before games to get my arm prepared and ready because you never want to go out and just start throwing and have something happen to your arm and you're out for a long period of time. So this is part of my uh, pregame ritual every game. This is my leg guard. I don't use this as much. It's, it's a lot older, and um, but I just have it just in case I foul one off my shin or something and then uh, I want to cover it up for a little while. But I don't, I don't use it very often. This is my pine tar. I normally always have this in my bag. I normally have the, the tiger sticks, but uh, I lost mine a couple weeks back. But So I just have the, the spray on that I normally use for all my bats. Uh, this is my arm sleeve, and I also have my headband. I normally always wear both of these together. I, I like the white arm sleeves, or I'll wear another arm sleeve that matches the color of the jersey. I always uh, have an arm sleeve on it. I always have since I was a kid. Uh, these are my tapes. I use these for um, before each game. I'll wrap my wrist. I'll either wrap one or I'll wrap both. Um, I normally use this this black self adhesive one because this this white one it sticks to your skin pretty pretty hard. So, it, <laughs> but uh, so yeah. And then I always have a couple of baseballs on me at all times, just in case your coach is late or something and you don't have the bucket on you at a tournament or something. So you need to warm up. I always have baseballs on me. Hey guys, since we hit 10,000 subscribers on the channel, YouTube let me open up a merch store right on my channel. All you have to do is go to my channel, click the store tab, then click an item and it will take you right to the merch store. Every item sold is helping grow the channel and bring you guys more videos. So check it out, be sure to subscribe, and don't forget to like this video. And once again, guys, thank you so much for supporting the channel and getting it to 10,000 subscribers.